Hey Star Wars fans and collectors, Jesse here. Welcome back to another Star Wars The Black Series 6 inch action figure review. The last of the Rebels set that uh, just recently came out this year. Uh, they all got a makeover um, except for Ezra and Chopper, which were, you know, they were, they were up there with the rest anyway. Um, been waiting for this one for a little while. She'd got a little bit of a hold up, um, but it is Sabine Wren. So uh, I will be doing a comparison with the original Sabine Wren, um, just to show the, just to show the subtle differences between, uh, you know, the paint deco and that's pretty much it. There's not a lot of difference, but uh, cool to have this one, super realistic looking Sabine. She looks fantastic, um, and yeah, nice to finish the crew. The existing Sabine is fine. I've kept her helmet on, but uh, I'm looking forward to displaying this one with the helmet off. So let's check her out. All right, so here we have the updated version of Sabine Wren. She's looking pretty damn good. Uh, I didn't think there was too much wrong with the old figure. It was, it was pretty pretty damn fine. Um, she's looking great. Most of the update here is her, is her face paint apps, and uh, as I did with the most recent Rebels figures as well that I reviewed, I did do a comparison. So let's bring in the old one, and uh, yeah. I don't know, I really like the new one. I think the, the changes in hair colour are probably a bit nicer on the old one. Um, in terms of like paint and colour, they're practically exactly the same. Uh, the wolf on the shoulder of the, the old one's a little bit redder. And it's actually in the lines, whereas the new one isn't quite there. But that's okay, it's not a big deal. Yeah, no major differences. Uh, they've changed the skin tone a little bit. It's barely noticeable here, mainly in the face. But yeah, we'll get a nice close up look. Fantastic, I really, really dig this a lot. So good to finally have the full crew of the Ghost updated, looking fantastic. It's great to have that complete set. Uh, the helmets are exactly the same as well. Here is the new one. Next to <laughs> no, I've dropped it. That's gone. And here's the old one. And uh, the new one actually had some of the black paint. Hadn't quite made it all the way into the uh, into the visor. So I'll be using using the old helmet with the new Sabine. So it's cool. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the old one yet. I may uh, I may do some custom work at some point. But like the other figures, I'll probably just Put them away in the cupboard somewhere. Maybe save them for a giveaway. But yeah, she comes with her blasters. I know I recently reviewed the uh, Clone Wars Mandalorians, and I said these were new blasters, and I'd completely forgotten that uh, they had come with Sabine already. So she was the first one to utilize these blasters in action figure form, at least in the Black Series. Paint, extra paint on her back there. I don't think that was on the old one. Nope. A little bit messy there, but could just end up doing a simple head swap. So the old one's paint apps are a little bit better overall on the figure. But uh, yeah, nice to have this one. Anyway, still got a spray gun. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you think below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. I've always got new content coming out and uh, new figures to review and all that good stuff. So just scroll back through my channel, come check out the collection. But yeah, thanks very much for watching guys. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Until my next review, may the force be with you. Always. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.